Welcome back to the year-end edition of the Best of Just Books 2011. What were the great, the good, the bold and the beautiful reading in the year? Here are excerpts from the best of the interviews we recorded. Hello, I'm Sanjana Kapoor and I'm here at the Pitti Theatre where I work um, in my most favourite little corner of the Pitti Theatre, the Pitti Bookshop. And here are some of my most favourite books. In fact, I've just seen a book that I've not read and I've not bought. Che Guevara, a manga biography. What could be more delightful? This is my next buy. And of course, this being summertime, the bookshop is inundated with kids' books. And my all-time favorite, of course, is Roald Dahl. And I'm getting to revisit him in his children's avatar because of my son, who's nine, and who's completely in love with Roald Dahl. My all-time favorite, of course, is this incredible collection of his short stories. Incredibly dark and wonderful. He really is a master. It is so close to what theater does. Reading a book makes you use your imagination. It makes you use your senses. It makes you work. And I believe truly good theater makes you work. It engages you. It activates you. It gets you to participate and be involved. Not in the same way that cinema or theater or, or, or TV does. They are incredibly passive. They don't engage you in the same way. Whereas theater demands that you participate, like books do. Um, reading for me is a uh, habit and of relaxation and uh, I read every day before I go to bed for about half an hour 40 minutes the rest of the day is far too disturbing and work so I don't manage to read I have a huge collection of books uh, collected over the past 30 40 years inherited from my parents inherited from my father-in-law and uh, my interests vary uh, there are many books uh, which I read over and over again or just refer to them like Alice in Wonderland, uh, writings on Mahatma Gandhi, teachings of Mahatma Gandhi, sayings of Mahatma Gandhi. There is Jawaharlal Nehru's books which I refer to very often which you can see a whole lot of them over here. Then uh, I also go and read literature like Jane Austen or David Copperfield uh, or Dickens uh, to just recall many of the good passages that have been forgotten over time. I always uh, take a break in the afternoon and when I want to prepare myself for the rest of their day, I look at comic books because they're very relaxing. Asterix, Tintin, Biggles are my favorite. And of course, some of the children's stories that uh, both the Book Trust of India publishes, Delhi publishers publish, as well as foreign books, especially the books by Dr. Swiss. Uh, which all my grandchildren have and I don't know whether they how much they enjoy them but I certainly do and uh, that refreshes me for the other half of my day which lasts till 10 and 11. NDTV's Cricket app Android and iPhone faster scorecard special analysis and much more download free ndtv.com slash apps